What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today we're going to be going over the deals and discounts for the PlayStation 4 EU side of things. We're going to be checking out the deals and offers and all that good juicy stuff. Last time I made a video I used this theme, everybody was asking me what theme am I using. It's called Nightmares Unhinged, it's pretty sweet. I did a video review of it. Uh, a little while ago, but um, I guess some of you guys didn't see that, so I just wanted to give you guys a heads up and let you know about that as well. So we get the deals and offers. We get a January sale, save up to 60%. Let's go ahead and check those deals out. We got Need for Speed. The full game is $24.99. You get the Deluxe Edition, which is just a little bit more for $29.99. I would probably go with this one if you're going to be getting Need for Speed. There's been a lot of mixed reviews about Need for Speed. I personally have purchased it but it's in my black backlog of games to be honest with you um because i'm playing other games at the moment but i'm going to be getting to it um and i'll give you guys my opinions on it once i've actually played it all the way through i've only played like demos during e3 and all that good stuff black ops 3 34.99 59.99 if you want the deluxe edition we got fifa 16 the deluxe edition 29.99 we got the super deluxe edition for 34.99 it looks like it comes with garden warfare but i'm not sure because the playstation network's already experiencing technical difficulties on christmas so i if if i click on it it's gonna say maintenance and then it's just a mess right now. Um, we got Grand Theft Auto $32.99. We got the Shark um, Cash Card Bundle $36.50. The bundle comes with the game and some extra cash. You might want to pick this one up as opposed to just the red regular digital copy. We got Mad Max. If you have PlayStation Plus, you get to save an extra additional 10%. Wow. Amazing, right? $22.50. 49 excuse me we get the destiny taking king 1999 we got the taking king legendary edition 24.99 we get the destiny taking king collector's edition uh for 44.99 we get the witcher 3 we got rocket league is on sale right now ladies and gentlemen if you didn't pick this up and you barely have uh purchased a playstation plus subscription maybe you just got a playstation 4 i definitely recommend this game this game is so freaking awesome and it's definitely worth a lot more than the price tag you guys see right there i'm actually going to scroll through these a little bit quicker um just to get through some of them we got battlefield um i would probably recommend battlefield 4 all you battlefield fans uh let me know in the comment section below but I, what i would recommend to a lot of you guys is probably battlefield 4 battlefield hardline is pretty awesome that's the newest one that just came out but a lot of hardcore battlefield uh fans are actually going with Battlefield 4 still, and a lot of people are still paying, playing Battlefield 4. But hey, if you wanted to get both, and you have PlayStation Plus, there's a sale right now. The bundle's $22.49. I would probably recommend this, and if not, maybe you want to try Battlefield 4. Maybe you want to try Hardline. I don't know. That's really up to you guys. Tomb Raider Definite Edition. This game is absolutely beautiful. And I loved every second of playing it. It, it was just jaw-dropping um, just to, to play through the whole thing. My heart was racing. I definitely recommend this. Um, I played it and I loved it. And I definitely recommend it. We got Metal Gear Solid Ground Zeroes for $3.99. This one broke my heart because I was so excited when it came out. Like, uh, okay... I'm waiting for Metal Gear Solid 5, but Ground Zeroes is coming out, and it was exciting for me just to play it for 15 minutes and finish the game, and I was just like, what? Um, but if you want to get Ground uh, Ground Zeroes, that's $3.99. Metal Gear Solid 5, which is actu the actual game, the Phantom Pain, that's the actual game, which is awesome. It is $39.99. We got some Drive Club up in here. You got the Drive Club full game for $15.99. We got the full game for PlayStation Plus exclusive, baby, $7.99. We got Drive Club the full game for... Why? Okay, the Drive Club full game for PlayStation Plus and Season Bundle $9.99. Might as well go with this one if you're going to be picking it up. 
and you have PlayStation Plus, why not? I, I would actually scratch that off because you get everything plus the season pass for $9.99. Who wouldn't want that? We get Need for Speed Rivals, pretty cool, $9.99. I would definitely recommend getting Need for Speed, but... You know, since this one's a little bit cheaper than Need for... Let's see how much Need for Speed was. I already forgot, guys. Okay, $24.99 for the regular game. If you're going to be picking it up, maybe... If, if you don't have that much to spend, maybe you want to get this one. I don't know, but I definitely recommend uh, Need for Speed, the one that we just saw up above. This one's pretty cool, too, though. Ooh, Metal... Uh, Metal Gear. Duh. Devil May Cry 4 and Devil May Cry Definite Edition. Now, these are definitely a must. These are awesome. We got Shovel Knight, which is uh, one of your more typically harder games to play. What is pretty awesome is this is an indie game. And not too many indie titles actually get a, a shot at a physical copies and I just wanted to throw that out there for you guys I have seen physical copies of Shovel Knight which got me super excited when I saw it um, it runs for about $20 US dollars over here um, not sure how much it goes for over there in Europe we get Madden 16 26 09 uh, which is an odd number but if you have PlayStation Plus that's what it is Dragon Ball is also an awesome game. The Evil Within Us is amazing. The Crew, a lot of people liked it. Some people hated it. it. It's a give or take. I mean, if you want to drive across America and in the time that it would actually take, pretty much, um, then maybe you want to get this game. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It It is uh, based on multiplayer. And currently, I don't, I don't know if there's too many people playing it. Um, so I just wanted to throw that out there too. Dragon Age Inquisition is on sale right now, ladies and gentlemen. And if you have PlayStation Plus, it's a little bit less. 10% uh, less to be sp specific. Blah, 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 specific. <laughs> WWE 2K16, $44.99. And then the Deluxe Edition right here, $57.99. Um, I'm pretty sure Dragon Flop would be like, what? Tearaway Unfolded, fantastic game. If you haven't played it, I definitely recommend it. Um, Transformers Devastation. Uh, well, the price is a devastation because this was a AAA title and it, it was full price. And now it's $15.99. That is insane. Sleeping Dogs Definite Edition, $8.59. Now, this game's been out forever, so I mean, I can understand that. Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare, $7.99. That one's actually pretty good, good too. Odd World New and Tasty is a pretty funky, fun game. I definitely recommend that. Thief! A lot of people loved it, some people hated it. I, I actually watched uh, one dude's live stream. All the way through like every time he played it I watched it it was it was really fun to watch I haven't played it though to be honest with you but I've watched I, I've I forgot what the dude's name is if it comes to me then I'll definitely let me uh, let you know uh, his username in the video description down below um, but I I had a lot of fun watching him play thief I'm not sure if he still live streams or anything I'll definitely check that out and get back to you guys on that but just wanted to throw that out there it's a fantastic game haven't played it though. I just watched a, a complete live stream of it um, from beginning to end. Sniper Elite 3. This game was uh, advertised like hell through a bunch of YouTubers when it got released. Uh, unfortunately, it didn't do that well. It is uh, it's a decent game. If, if you have nothing else to play, maybe you want to pick this one up. Evolve is a fantastic game. I can't believe it's on sale for so cheap. It is a multiplayer game. Um, they have uh, offline as well where you can play, um, you know, just against the uh, computer AIs and all that good stuff. But it's definitely a fun game if you're playing online multiplayer. If you get a party together, sometimes what's fun is because you can have up to five people in a party. And let, let's say four of them are hunters, one of them's a monster. It's a lot of fun because, like, if 
with the PlayStation, you can actually you can actually have everybody in a party, and then at the same time, you can kind of hear the monster freaking out when the hunter's getting close and stuff. I know some people say that's cheating and everything, but I think it's I think it's fun that way. I mean, if you're playing as a monster and not talking to absolutely anybody, then I don't know. Some people like this sneaky stealth. Um, stealthing about you know playing as a monster and everything i do too but if i'm playing as a monster i'd rather play in a party and talk to my friends but evolve definitely a fantastic game if you guys haven't picked that up yet it it's really cheap right now and then they get the digital deluxe edition that comes with the hunting season pass we got kill zone shadowfall um you you could probably pick this up for a little bit less at a local game store to be honest with you guys um i picked up my copy over here in america for five dollars um that's a used copy of course but five dollars <laughs> just to put that into perspective for you rayman legends fantastic game if you guys haven't picked that up or played it at all Definitely recommend you guys doing so. The Walking Dead Season 2 is uh, pretty cool as well. Uh, the Walking Dead, the complete first season, is fantastic. I loved it. It's my favorite Telltale game because that's the one that sucked me into um, their, their crazy uh, storytelling. And, and just got me so freaking excited about all the other Walking Deads after that. We get Knack, which is on sale as well. We're, we'll go down the list a little bit quicker. See if anything pops out. Um, you guys can feel free to pause it at any time. Uh, PlayStation EU decided, you know what? We're going to throw in a whole bunch of sales because it's Christmas. Motorcycle Club, um, which is part of Drive Club, is on sale as well. Velocity 2, I definitely recommend that one. That one's an awesome game right here. This one is awesome. Um, and that's actually going to do it for the January sale. Holy cow, what, what else do we have? Okay, we get the PlayStation Plus exclusive discounts. We'll check that out in the next video. Be on the lookout for that um, because we've already gone about 12 minutes right now so if you watched up until this point make sure to hit a like if you haven't already subscribed that would be awesome as well and i will see you guys in the exclusive discounts for the playstation plus video i'll see you guys later